Hey guys, welcome back. Charles Damiano from the Bruce Lee Collection. For those of you who are new to this channel, what I do every week is I share with you different Bruce Lee collectibles from my collection. Magazines, figures, books, posters, autographs. And we also feature special guests who are big collectors around the world. So far on the show we had Hector Martinez, who you guys saw his collection in numerous episodes. Richard Torres. Uh, we had Harry McKenzie out of South Carolina. A week or two ago we featured... Peter Reynolds, one of my overseas friends out of Scotland. And this week what we're going to do is we're going to stay with the theme of featuring uh, collectors from around the world. And uh, I'm going to feature someone from England. His name is Dave Love. And he has an amazing collection. And I can't wait for you guys to see his collection. And Dave was nice enough to uh, want to be on the show and sent me numerous dozens and dozens of pictures of his collection. And before we begin, I'm going to Give you a little background about Dave. Dave started collecting Bruce Lee memorabilia in 1974, like most of us. He was eight years old. And when I asked him what his uh, first collectible was, it was the giant Kung Fu uh, ma monthly magazine uh, that he picked up in 1974 when he was eight years old. And uh, I asked him what his top three collectibles are. And it's always so hard to narrow it down to top three. But Dave said he loves his Kung Fu uh, monthly poster magazines where there's 70 and all in the collection. Uh, he also uh, loves his uh, Game of Death Blitzway statue. I don't know if you guys have ever seen it, but I'll show a picture of it. It's a huge, maybe 18, 24-inch Game of Death statue uh, from Blitzway. And Dave has some amazing uh, movies, Super 8 movies on Bruce Lee, which he takes pride in, which uh, a lot of which you'll see and, uh, in the video today. Dave was also, when I asked him how he was inspired by Bruce Lee, he said he can't remember a day that he wasn't inspired by Bruce Lee, and almost every day of his life, he tries to use Bruce Lee's philosophies in everything he, he does, from his work to his uh, improvement on himself, and he thinks about Bruce Lee uh, all the time because he had such a big influence in his life like he did for most of us. So what I'm going to do today is I'm going to feature Dave's collection in a beautiful picture gallery, uh, played to music, uh, and you guys will see uh, some of Dave's collection. Uh, Dave was also inspired uh, by him uh, during school. He studied judo. In high school, he said he studied karate. In the 80s, he studied boxing. And then in the 90s, he, stu he studied Bruce Lee's martial art, Jeet Kune Do. So he was really, really inspired by Bruce Lee in a lot of ways, like most of us, us were. So uh, for now, what I'm going to do is i like you guys to take a glimpse into Dave Love's Brucey Collection. Enjoy.
and welcome back. I hope you guys enjoyed a glimpse into Dave Love's Bruce Lee collection. I want to thank David for sending us uh, pictures of his collection. Uh, what I was most impressed with is not only the items that Dave shared with us, but also how he displayed his items very eloquently in beautiful glass cases, bookshelves, and I think that's what other collectors really love seeing, how collectors just display their items, and we get ideas from that, and I know I have a lot of collectors writing in saying, hey, I picked up some great ideas, now I know how I would like to or organize my Bruce Lee collection. So once again, thank you, Dave. I'm sure Dave's going to love hearing from you guys, so please comment. Let Dave know what you thought of his collection. Let Dave know how much you appreciated seeing his collection. Please write in, comment, like the video. Uh, also, if any of you guys like to share your Bruce Lee collection with me, please write in. My email is in the description below. You can email me at cdbrlee at aol.com as we build this Bruce Lee community. Uh, we uh, love seeing collectors' collections, so please let me know if you like to share, share yours with the group. And uh, once again, Charles Damiano signing out from the Bruce Lee collection, saying have fun collecting.